Ladies and gentlemen, Act Blue is now collapsing. The world now knows that Act Blue is nothing more than a money laundering machine for the left wing party. The far left, the progressives, the tyrannical corrupted officials, the socialists, the communists, they're all using Act Blue. And they're putting people's names that are elderly on Social Security illegals and saying that they're the ones donating all of these small amounts. And they're always bragging that 80% of our donations were from small donations, people, individuals who gave $5 or less. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. There's not enough people in this country that would give the Democrats that much money to outraise Republicans. Why? Because we know that most of the country leans right. That's why most states are Republican states. And now there's an investigation opening up into Act Blue. From who? None other than Missouri Attorney General, Attorney General Bailey. This guy is on fire. I want to go ahead and cue that drum roll because he's going to get the Smarty Award of the Day today. Attorney General Andrew Bailey from the Show Me State of Missouri. You get... The Smarty Award of the Day today because he's opening up a full investigation into Act Blue. And he is the state attorney general, folks. And when more attorneys general jump onto this, it's going to be because they're going to find out that it's an interstate, countrywide, I would say maybe even global money laundering scheme. So big shout out to attorney general for Missouri, Andrew Bailey. Guess what else just happened because of that? Act Blue has disabled their credit card verification process so that as long as the card numbers are valid, the name and the address do not need to match the actual credit card owner. No other donation platform on earth allows this. And it results in a higher transaction fee. Think about that. I want you to go on, try to buy something with your credit card. Right now, put the wrong name and address. Attach that card. Tell me if it goes through. I can guarantee you it doesn't. And if it does, you might never want to shop with those people ever again because Act Blue is becoming even more brazen as they get ready to collapse. And the world knows they're getting ready to collapse. Are they trying to gain as much money as they can? Now, if you don't know about my reporting, three plus years ago about Act Blue, it was all tied to BLM. We were following the money of the people that were donating to Black Lives Matter. When you've donated to Black Lives Matter or Antifa, for that matter, the hyperlink took you off of that site and brought you to a site called Act Blue. And when you went to Act Blue, you donate through Act Blue and that's where they would raise the money. Once they raised the money, they then used that money not to go to BLM, except the higher ups, not to help black people out of impoverished neighborhoods, not to Antifa. It actually went to Democrat candidates who you could go and vote for who were going to be BLM, Antifa, and Summer of Love in the Streets activist friendly. That's what we uncovered three plus years ago. Then James O'Keefe took it to a whole nother level when he found out that a majority of the donations that were coming in weren't even from the people that they said they were from. Think about that. So I have this video here exposing Act Blue Democrat money laundering operation. This was sent to me on Instagram, so it's going to be in an Instagram. Instagram format. And I want to show you these uh, New Orleans, Louisiana resident who said that she lives on Social Security and did not contribute to Act Blue in the amount of $29,000 between 2016 and 2019. Roll this clip. You donated 1,113 times. So like four no, times no. a day. No, that's not possible. About $13,347.84. No, so that's not possible. And the year before that, in 2021, 715 times, about $6,957.90. No, sir. No, sir. Did not. Okay. And then uh, 2020, 839 times, about $6,983.10. No, sir. Okay. Just from, uh, then from 2016 to 2022, just total in that year about twenty nine thousand one hundred seven dollars. I don't have that kind of money, sir. I'm on Social Security. I don't. I don't have that kind of money to donate. Okay, sir. That's not not even possible. I can't even. I don't even get on the my phone or the internet that much. I have donated to political parties in the past. I do do that, but I there's no way on earth I donate five, six times a day to somebody. Huge. Now, James O'Keefe went around door to door and did this, what, about a year ago now? Maybe a little less? And this is just an expansion upon that. More and more people are going out there and digging into this. And Act Blue is going to be a thing of the past very soon, folks, especially with Attorney General Andrew Bailey from Show Me State of Missouri on it. So big shout out to him. Hey everyone, thank you very much for watching. If you want to watch more or maybe even catch an entire episode of Live from America, all you have to do is watch us daily at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on rumble.com slash LFA TV. See you there.